With all the talk about the coronavirus, one thing we keep hearing is how important it is to wash your hands. So I am joined today by Dr. Roberto Colon. He's the Associate Chief Medical Officer at Miami Valley Hospital, and he's going to give us some pro tips on making sure that we're washing our hands correctly. What's the first thing that you notice people not doing right when it's time to wash your the hands? The first thing is people don't wash enough. And we should be washing our hands for at least 20 seconds. The rule of thumb is you can either say the alphabet song or sing the birthday song twice. Uh, and that usually is a good barometer that you're doing it long enough to be able to get enough friction in your hands and be able to actually get all the surfaces clean. Okay, take me through step by step. What yeah. do we need to do? Is it important to make the water hot before you get started? The water temperature is not as important. So the first thing you want to do is you want to turn on the water, get your hands wet, and then you want to be able to get soap, whether it's bar soap or it's going to be the liquid soap in your hand after you get the soap. You want to make sure that you lather up really, really well and that you're cleaning every surface. One of the common things people will do is they'll rub their hands together, but they forget about the back surfaces of their hands. So you want to make sure that you're cleaning both the uh, palm side as well as the back of the hands pretty well underneath the water. There are two components to hand washing. The first one is the rinsing. That is the water, the soap, that is going to be able to help get the germs out. The other is actually the friction, and that's where the part of making sure that you're rubbing your hands together on the front to the back are going to help with the cleaning action. All right, Dr. Roberta Colon, we really appreciate your advice here. Very important Absolutely. information as we try to stop the spread of all illness, really, not just coronavirus, but the flu and anything else that might be floating around out there.